Hi Linda. Uh, this is Friday the second. This morning in about two hours time this extruder paid for itself. I just took clay conditioned it. The extruder has an octagon um, disc which is the biggest opening that I have and I I ran I made logs I didn't do the disc thing I just rolled everything conditioned it rolled it up in a ball and rolled it into a little sausage and put it in the extruder and started and um, cranking it out and some of the cane made you know multiples because I didn't want them real long this is about four inches but look I wrapped all of these in black on number two the jelly rolls were on three and five the color is on five the black is on three and um, I started this because I wanted to try and do the kaleidoscope and I also wanted to experiment with what they call the retro cane so this extruder just makes it possible to make small canes really quickly and <coughs> you can even stack <coughs> different colors and get different effects so that as you slice the cane it changes color and on this video too I'm going to show you what I am about to experiment with I went to my Frankie be quiet I went to my dollar jewelry store and they had these bang, uh, bangle cuffs they're pretty thick you can tell by my my thumbnail and the, the plastic I heard a chick say on YouTube the other day that this plastic would not melt when you had applied clay to it so for a buck a piece I bought I bought nine of them this was I didn't really realize what I was looking at I like this one better but the rest of them are transparent not quite as thick but I'm gonna cover them with clay and see what we come up with and that would save on a lot of clay because I really believe that by the time I run a blank out to put the chrysanthemum or whatever shavings I want on there that's more than a buck <laughs> that is more than a dollar right there so um, until Michael has their 99 cent haul but I just wanted to encourage you to make a ton of these little canes just because the uh, jelly rolls are are a little bigger and this one uh, especially it's about a half an inch and um, these are tiny they're about three eighths of an inch that one right there so but just to have those made in my way of thinking a a cane that's made is an <laughs> asset one that's not is a liability and these can be stored and wait for whatever outside I want to roll up on them I mean uh, I may you know want to put a different color besides black on there so that's where I'm going with that and and um, again whatever sculpy color you use make sure that you've got 50% translucent so that you and uh, the primo translucent so that you keep the uh, flexibility so I will um, put out another video when I know more.
Love you, babe. Bye.